Hello everybody. Uh, today we're going to see the unboxing of EmoQ HBA1C 501 analyzer. This is how the box looks like. I'm just going to go around the box. You can see this. You see IVD certified product and uh, this is distributed by the HemoQ Sweden. You can see the lot number and the manufacturing reference. We have a FT tag here. Okay. You can see a lot. On the other side. Okay, this is the what the box looks like. Okay, I'm going to unbox this for you. Okay, got it. Okay, there is a, there is a card which talks about the. You can see that it talks about the instruction of use. How to operate the machines? You can see this card on the side. Step one, step two, step three, step four, and the other modes. I'm keeping this here, okay? Okay, then you can see this. There's a box. There is a box covered. And inside, actually, this uh, these are the controls cartridges. That is like uh, daily control check cartridges HP one C five zero one, and uh, you have a monthly check cartridge. When you buy the machine, it comes along with the machine. You can see the inside. Inside, you have a, a big manual. Like so many pages are there. You can see there are two, uh, two languages, you can see this here and you can see an English operating manual, a complete uh, detailed operating manual for this analyzer. So you have a two language here and then you have the machine here, I think you need to do the machine, okay, let me put this here. can see this how the machine looks like you have a mode down up and printer button you have the back side of the machine you can see this here you can see you have a, the power adapter the usb port power on, on button you can see the details behind HB and AC501 analyzer and you have the reference part number and also the voltage range and the model number actually yeah. it's a CEIVD certification also it's the bottom of the bottom looks like okay. Okay, let me keep the machine here okay, let me see what else is inside okay Okay, inside you can see a filter paper. Okay, that says fan filter. It says fan filter. And inside you also have adapter cables. Let me take those cables. Okay, 
So we have two types of power uh, power cables. This is one type. With the, you can see the difference. And we have a three plug type. And we have the adapter. You can fix the adapter in this. So you have uh, power adapter cables. Okay, this is the whole contents of this machine. Let me keep this here. And uh, the ease of load wheel. Just putting everything here. Okay. You can see this. Okay, to quickly summarize, um, in the box of uh, HemoQ HB A1C501 analyzer, you get an uh, instruction card and uh, you get a, an, a manual and you get a filter paper and you get the mission and also you get the three cable set as the adapter and other cables. And you also uh, get this um, monthly check cartridge and also this daily check cartridges but it, it comes outside the box but we have kept inside the box to show you these are the contents of the mission. So you can see a total look is here. This is MOQ501 layer so. Thank you. Welcome to the HemoQ HBA1C501 system instruction for use video. In this video, you will learn how to start up the analyzer. Startup. Make sure the analyzer is placed horizontally and on a stable surface. Ensure that the analyzer power button is off and the lid is closed. Connect the power adapter to the analyzer to appropriate grounded AC electrical outlet. Start the analyzer by turning the power switch on. Close the lid if opened. Warming up will start. The display will show warming up until the device is ready for use, showing standby mode. In standby mode, press mode button and hold for three seconds. Choose between setup and data mode by using the arrow keys and choose Setup by pressing the Mode button. Select Date Format by pressing arrow keys. Press Mode to select Format. Set Date by using the arrow keys. Select Time Format by using the arrow keys. Choose 12 hour or 24 hour by pressing Mode. Select Unit for test result by using the arrow keys. Press Mode button to select unit. If applicable, select barcode and printer in the same way using Mode button and arrow keys. Your analyzer is now set up and ready for use. For more information, please visit hemoq.com. Welcome to the HemoQ HBA1C501 system instructions on capillary sampling and measuring. Open the lid. Open the test cartridge package by tearing the pouch on the side with the serrated edge. Do not use scissors to open the pouch. The test cartridge consists of a cartridge and a reagent pack when insert cartridge is displayed, insert the cartridge with the barcode facing left. A gentle snap is heard that confirms proper placement. Gently mix by turning the reagent pack back and forth five to six times before applying blood sample. Do not shake. Collect a blood sample. Gently touch the blood sample with the tip of the sampling area. The blood is automatically drawn into the sampling area. Hold the reagent pack at a 45 degree angle. Ensure that the sampling area is completely filled. Insert the reagent pack in the cartridge and gently push into cartridge compartment. Close the lid. The test will then start automatically. The result is displayed after five minutes. Remove cartridge after the test is completed by gently pushing it to the left and pull out. For your own safety, please remember to wear protective gloves, handle blood with care, 
and follow local safety procedures for disposal of used cartridges. Welcome to the HemoQ HBA1C501 system instructions on cleaning and maintenance of the analyzer. Disconnect the analyzer before cleaning. Recommended maintenance routines are exterior cleaning of the analyzer, cartridge compartment cleaning, and replacing fan filter. Start exterior cleaning by wiping off the analyzer using a soft, clean cloth. If necessary, an alcohol swab can be used. Other chemical solutions should not be used. Cleaning solutions may cause damage to the analyzer surface. When the lid is opened, press the two black knobs to rotate the cartridge compartment forward. Moisten a swab with ethanol or recommended commercial disinfectant. Gently wipe off the cartridge compartment with the swab. Be careful not to spill any liquids into the analyzer.